We are a high-performing charter school network. By the fall, we'll have four schools serving 1,500 kids. We call ourselves a college prep elementary school because we believe that the foundation for college begins early on. I'm learning concepts on a more complex level. I know that I'll be ready to work even harder to learn new things. 99% have actually graduated from high school, 83% matriculated to a four-year college, and, and another 12% matriculated to a two-year college. So almost 95% did something after high school. We also put our current eighth grade class. I mean, they're going to the best, most selective public and private high schools in the city. We are very focused on culture. Our number one goal is for our students to attend and graduate from college. Every single member from the parents, to from the teachers, from the office managers, we all are very clear about how the role we play enables our students to be successful. You have to be ready for the kids because they're coming sharp. Even the kids that I get from pre-K, they're coming in on top of it. And I'm teaching a grade level above where they are. And then in some cases, maybe two. See where the students struggle, see where they're excelling, and you can just push them exactly where they need it. So it's less of just teaching to a, a group of students, but really about teaching to that specific child and teaching to what it is that that child needs. Starts to write on this paper, raise your hand, what am I gonna ask you to do? Before he starts the paper, what am I gonna ask? Marlene. Uh, it's not just the academic piece, but the social, emotional, psychological, and physical needs of the child must also be addressed if we're going to fulfill our mission. Learn really enforces the characteristics that your parents instill in you at home. They teach you responsibility for your actions. What you're doing is for the right reasons and you know the difference between right and wrong and what can help you later on in life. When parents put their kids in Learn Charter, they, they keep them here. So there's that relationship that's built and sustained both with parents and with the students that I think without that, I just feel like you can't do your job with education. The environment that they've created here is welcoming. It makes you feel like you belong. As soon as you walk through the door, you know, everybody's friendly, extremely helpful. I've never had any issues with any any of the staff. When we have partnerships, we have an open door policy and our partners are in our building. We meet with them. We talk about these are our strengths. These are our struggles. We talk about, you know, how can we become better in this area? We don't hide. And because of that, we have true partners and because of that, we're able to move and grow. We have parents who just walk by and say, hmm, this school, this building looks like this in North Lawndale, like you don't see this. One of the neighbors came and she brought a backpack and she said, this belongs to one of your students. And I thought to myself, well, how did you know they didn't have one of uniforms today because they had some kind of special event? And she said, I know a learned student when I see one. There was a difference. They're confident, they're highly intelligent, and they're thinkers. They have the ability to, to process, to make decisions. They're respectful. These students are everything we want our children to be, everything we need to become leaders.